Hey guys, welcome to School of Rock. I'm Pastor Jason. Today, we're gonna be learning from the ultimate loudmouth. His name was Simon. Here's his backstory. He was a fisherman. He was one of the first guys chosen by Jesus to follow him. He was one of Jesus' closest friends. And he had no filter. When I say he had no filter, I mean he said whatever came to mind. Does that sound like someone you know? Does that sound like you? Has anyone ever said to you, you need to think before you speak? If so, you have more in common with Simon than you thought. One time, Jesus was telling everyone that he was gonna die and come back to life. Simon began to rebuke Jesus. Do you know what a rebuke is? A rebuke is what your mom does to you when you do something wrong. Simon was doing that to Jesus, the Son of God. He rebuked him saying, Jesus, quit telling people that you're gonna die. This will never happen to you. Jesus said, get behind me, Satan. You're laying a dangerous trap for me. Whoa, I wouldn't like Jesus calling me the devil. Simon's mouth got him in trouble. Now, if we stopped here, you'd say, obviously, God wants me to keep quiet, keep my mouth shut. But hold on, God made your voice and made you who you are and made Simon the loud mouth that he was. And there was a moment in the life of Simon when that loud mouth was noticed by Jesus in a good way. Jesus was asking his followers, who do you say that I am? The followers told Jesus what other people were thinking. They weren't bold enough to share their thoughts. Jesus looked right at Simon and said, but who do you say that I am? And it's at this moment, when he's staring at Simon, when he's looking at Simon, that Simon, who had no problem sharing, said to Jesus, you are the Christ, the Savior, the Son of the living God. Jesus said, Simon, you are blessed because you didn't learn this from any human. My Father in heaven has shown you this. Then Jesus said something that changed Simon's whole life. He changed Simon's name. Simon, you are now Peter. The name Peter means rock. And on this rock, I will build my church and all the powers of hell will not stand up against it. Whoa, Simon, whose name became Peter, shared the rock of truth. Jesus is the savior, the son of the living God. Then Jesus changed his name and said that he would build his whole future church on this rock of truth and he would use Simon Peter, the rock, to do it. That's huge. God made Peter's voice and yours too. Maybe you're not outspoken. Maybe you tend to be on the shy side. God wants to use your voice to speak truth and like Simon Peter, make an impact in the lives of people around you.